Send to. This demo will give you a quick overview of the Send to plugin. Whenever you plan to send emails to a group, Send to is at your disposal to greatly facilitate such routine tasks. To create a message to a group of recipients using Send to, just select one or more items of the following types. All available addresses from these items will be retrieved and added to the recipient list. In this demo, let's select a few emails. There are many ways you can access Send to. You can right click on the items and invoke the shortcut menu. Or you can access the Send to toolbar drop down menu. Or you can click on the Outlook Actions menu. You can just click the Send To button here. This button remembers the last action, in this case, To. All the email IDs from the items that we selected will be retrieved and added to the recipient list. Send To has the ability to insert the required contact details, for example, full name, first name, middle name, etc., retrieved from the contact form in Outlook for each recipient of a group message into a selected place in the message. Let's select first name. As you see, this is inserted into the body. In the actual email, this will be replaced by the real name of the recipient. Send to also has a few sending modes. The default is the send separately mode. This will send the group message as a separate email to each recipient. After typing the email and entering the subject, let's send the email. Now, Send To gives us a chance to confirm that we want to send the emails. Press Yes to continue. Emails are being sent. Let's see if the sent emails are in the Sent Items folder. Yes, as you see, all the five emails are in the Sent Items folder. Let's open one email and see what it looks like. As you see, the name has been inserted in place of the placeholder, First Name. This way, each recipient gets an individual email addressed to him personally. Let's now explore the various options that Send2 provides us to customize our sending further. You can access the Send2 options from anywhere. Let's try the toolbar this time. The first tab allows you to exclude and or include certain items based on our preference. The items selected on the folder pane manually are always added to a recipient list, regardless of the specified options. This tab provides a way to customize the appearance. For example, you can flag all emails sent from Send2 to have a red flag in the Drafts folder. The last tab lets you customize the recipient group size and time interval for emails to be sent to each group. This is a very useful feature and helps us avoid many spam filters. Send2 also allows you to create and send an email to a new distribution list in only a few clicks. After selecting a few emails, click on the Send To menu. Select Create New Distribution List from the menu. A new distribution list is created with all the contacts within the items that we selected. Just enter a name for the list and save it. That brings us to the end of this short demo on Send To. Thank you for viewing this demo. When you don't have Send To, Sending mass emails may take a great deal of your time. As you saw, Send2 allows you to easily create a new email in response to multiple messages.